Hundreds gathered to remember a Longmont woman murdered outside her home. Police say Michaela Grote was stabbed to death by a 15-year-old boy one week ago, and now her parents pay tribute to her life in a place she loved. Denver 7 Sally Mamdu was there. The racing community, as well as friends and family of Michaela, gather at the Colorado National Speedway to honor her memory and emotional tribute at a place she called second home. The loud revved engines and smell of gasoline is how 20-year-old Michaela Grote would have wanted her funeral. A wish her family honored at the Colorado National Speedway, Michaela's once happy place. More than 20 race cars lined up for four memorial laps. Leading the pack is this super late model. It's a car Michaela was looking forward to driving. The second car behind it is Michaela's car. Inside of it, her ashes. At every lap, drivers wave Michaela's racing car number one to her grieving father, Troy Grote. With his hand on his heart, barely holding back tears, Troy waved his daughter's number back. Then on the last lap, Troy hopped into his daughter's car and joined the drivers. At the end of the memorial laps, Troy stood in front of his daughter's car holding her ashes. This is a time for us to remember the life God gave Michaela. An emotional tribute to start her funeral service, a service that saw hundreds of people touched by Michaela's life. Her best friend describing her as her soulmate. I believe that there are multiple types of soulmates, and I also believe that you only have a few in your life, and Michaela was definitely one of mine. Michaela's father describing her as a passionate angel. Michaela had a passion for everything she did. If it was school, work, racing, Taking care of her family, she gave it 110%. Now that she's been called home, she can give it 110% as an angel to everybody. Her 14-year-old brother, Justin, too emotional to read what he wrote. She would always try to kiss me. I would run, hide, or wipe it off. She was loved by so many people, and when she was taken from us, she went to a better place. And finally, Michaela's boyfriend telling those in attendance to remember only the good. Don't be angry, don't be sad, it's, you know. Let her happiness and her good shine through. In Weld County, Sally Memdu, Denver 7.